Happy News Day, Oil Traders. It is still August 2nd, and it's just after 3 o'clock Eastern Time here on the East Coast of North America. And as you can see, we're up amazingly. Uh, news was uh, bearish, sort of. Uh, we still got a inventory crude draw, but basically half the size that was expected. So in that sense, it was bullish, but bearish. And that sort of explains the the, uh, the trading that happened today. Um, so here's the drop that we saw yesterday, um, climbed back up rather rapidly, held, and then here's the news event right here at the far right of your screen where you see the long red followed by the long green. Um, that's That was our news event. So initially on news, we dropped uh, about 60 cents or so, and then pretty much went straight back up and above where we started uh, to a new high of the day, but still well below um, the $50 mark. Um, basically right now we're sitting at about $49.60 and we've been there for a fair bit and my suspicion is we're probably going to stay there into the closing, maybe fade a little bit, but um, that's pretty much it for today, um, it for Newsday, which is kind of disappointing. I, I kind of was hoping for something more. Obviously I was hoping for a drop since I'm bearish, but even if that wasn't to be the case, which apparently it wasn't, um, I would have liked to see something a little bit more bullish than what we got. Um, basically where we are right now, 4960, there's nothing to do. Um, right now it's just more wait and see until something um, develops and shows a clear sign of direction. Um, my positions are in, my targets, you guys know what they are already. Um, I'll be adding to my short positions if we get above 50-50, somewhere closer to 51 would be nice. And uh, if we end up dropping, um, either towards the closing, probably not, um, but tomorrow, then I'll be looking to start exiting positions at and below $48. Um, we'll see how that goes. Um, that's my feeling. Love to hear what you guys have in mind. Hit me up down below on YouTube in the comments or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, and charts. In the meantime, good luck, and I'll touch base with you guys ahead of trading tomorrow morning at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Good luck. Cheers.